I never had any aspirations to be a police chief. When I got into police work, I think it just kind of uh, naturally happened over time. While the so public I'm awaits a verdict in the Kimberly Potter trial, recently appointed Oakdale yeah, police chief Nick Newton is hard at work. Chief Newton, stand up guy. The right guy for the job. Implementing 21st century principles of policing, including community outreach, solid policies, and so, oversight. Uh, some of the things we want to keep building on as well. He was sworn in on September 14th, replacing longtime chief Bill Sullivan, who retired after more than three decades. Of course, Bill Sullivan retired here. Is Newton working his way up from patrol to now lead the department. I worked here a long time. I know this community and developed love for this community over the years and uh, being a public servant here for over 20 years um, just felt like the right next step. He says much has changed in policing attitudes over time, but his demand for accountability remains a top Not priority. Often in the past was it that a law enforcement officers involved in some controversial incident that people would protest at their residence. In May of 2020, a patrol sergeant at the time, Newton says the department faced their biggest challenge yet, Protesters gathering outside the house of now former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin, who's since been convicted and sentenced to 22 and a half years in prison for the murder of George Floyd. Morning after George Floyd died, a number of us watched what happened on video. And, I mean, it was disgusting. I mean, it's, it's everything that we train our staff to not do. Newton says in those four days he saw the best and worst of humanity and though difficult for the department, he managed meaningful exchanges with protesters, the department eventually holding a community forum. That was a very slow nine minutes of a person that was handcuffed on their stomach with a Minneapolis cop kneeling on the back of his neck until his death. So that first day we had the protests kind of had to step outside what we traditionally do and had a lot of converse, meaningful conversations with people saying, I watched the same video you did, I feel the same way. Yeah. With decades but, uh, of experience, Newton may be considered a veteran of the force yeah. and acknowledges how high profile cases have left public opinion of policing at an all time low. This profession, you are, need to be held accountable for what it is you do. Every decision you make is going to have a consequence. Yet he appears so renewed branch. by yeah, the job I, rather than weary, determined to place to justice, obvious. accountability, and humanity as guiding principles. Treating people with dignity and respect. Taking time to listen to people. Make fair and reasonable decisions. And always be able to explain your actions. Sometimes just basic humanity overrules. You know, I don't think you need to look much further than what happened with the death of George Floyd.